Hi, I'm Fristendra, and welcome back to the Silent Age. Trash can. Just trash. No, wait. There's a broom head down there. For a second there, I got all excited by the thought of renewing my old broom without filling out acquisition forms. I really need to find a different line of work. Yeah. Butcher shop window. It's a butcher shop. I know property prices in this town are t through the roof, but who in the right mind would open a butcher shop right next to a hospital? That seems questionable. Okay, so that's just the same. Ah, oh, bust mode. Nice. Hey, it opened the door. Things are finally looking up for me. Okay, let's check out this area in the future. Meat hook. It's so much scary looking meat hook. Okay. Mm hmm. Passage to hospital front. Dust. That looks like uh, not dust. There's something round underneath the dirt. Do I use the broom to get around? There's a manhole. Do I use the hook to raise it? To lift it? Heavy. Okay. A bar. To lose uh, rung from the ladder. I'm taking it with me. If anything survived this world, it'll be hungry by now and I need to do something to defend myself. A switch. It's probably been years since it worked. Okay, that sounds like a hint. Oh. Groovy. <laughs> Can I do anything with these? No, iron bars. Give it a few weeks and it'll probably be slime and slim enough. Ah, and I'll be slim enough. Okay, one more time. Those bars are way too thick. Bending them will be a will take a jack and I'll I've got something. I need a hacksaw or something to get through these babies. Alright, that's nothing. Uh the entrance is blocked. I can see the bottom of one of those red dumpsters through the holes in the lid. So I need to go to the future. Uh, okay. I thought the, the box would be covering it, but it was next to it. Bottle of turpentine. A fan. It's a bottle of turpentine, corrosive and flammable. This should come in handy. I probably shouldn't run off with the whole bottle though. The painter will notice it. it's gone and alert the officer. And you just keep on spinning, don't you? Can of paint. It's a can of paint. <laughs> Alright. Drain. I can feel the draft from the sewer tunnel below. Policeman. He's a police officer. I can make out a few words every time he raises his voice. He's clearly looking for someone. A sign. This is the place. Alright. Now I just need to get in there and hopefully find a time traveler guy. Time travel guy. Locked container. It is locked. Can I break the lock? Um, there's a police officer right at the entrance. I really don't want to be making that kind of noise. If I go to the future, though. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, smack. Mm, got it. The lock broke. And we have a bone saw. So I guess that's going to the bars underneath. There's a lighter wedge between his ribs. Okay. I've seen three dead people today. I should be able to stomach this by now. But the only thing keeping me from throwing up is how surreal all this feels. So you mean to say that in 40 years the painter didn't finish the wall. Hornet's nest. No. 
I'm crazy. Okay, then we will not get closer. I fell off the roof to the... Crap. Paint completed, right. Okay, if I do this again. I get the brothers of thing. I wish there was something to set fire to. Bees are afraid of fire, right? But I wanted to know about you falling down the 35th floor or something. Oh, yeah. Bam. I'm very curious about what happened. Why everyone died. And why some of the survivors ended themselves, like the individual. Man, I bet I could cut through a car with a saw. Aw, oh, shucks, it broke. Well, no cars will be cut by you then. A syringe. Um, okay. A syringe. Paramedics, paramedics must have dropped it down the drain. Okay. Oh yeah, crap! I forgot to check how it looks in the past. Blocked Maybe. passage. It is blocked by rubble. <gasps> there, the rain is the rubble. So there's rubble on both ends. It's a bunch of wooden beams must have been left by a hobo who never finished his fort. Can I light it on fire? Man. Occurred. All I get is part. Maybe I could add something flammable to the wood to help get it started. Okay, so I get the turpentine, put it in the wood, and light it fire. Then there's smoke, and then we get rid of the not rid of the bees, but then they will be. Oh yeah, crap. It is, well. it is blocked. Then they will be. Uh, I know that. I don't remember if they get dizzy or did this just just get slow or what? I, I, what am I supposed to do with the? That's a great way to avoid suspicion, Joe. Dum da dum dum. Nothing suspicious going on here, there. And I. It's a bit annoying that I kind of read most of the times it's half. Okay, so I got turpentine in the syringe. I spray the turpentine on the rubble. We light the rubble on fire. We smoke the bees. We escape. But uh, then again, I don't understand why he couldn't just take the entire bottle. The wood is soaking in turpentine. Man, that stuff smells heavy. Whoa! Oh, my sleeve almost got fired. The thing completely off the hook. I should use way less turpentine the next time I start a sewer fire. Hopefully, we won't be doing that too much now. Will we? Would we? I don't know. Why couldn't we just take the entire bottle of turpentine? Oh yeah, right, the entrance is blocked. Because we could just like grab it, go to the future, and walk away. I feel like using the syringe would make it seem more suspicious and take longer time. Instead of just grabbing the entire thing. Chapter 5. The corpse. More corpses? Okay, can I go outside again? I worked harder getting here than I ever have in my life. I'm not leaving now. Okay. What's in the garage? Button. There's no power. There's power. Cool. Car battery. <laughs> okay, so... I won't get far on foot. Getting here was hard enough, and that was barely a block and a half. Uh, okay. 
looks like someone is changing the tire. If we can just find some tools to finish the job, this ambulance could prove really useful. Okay, so the notes aren't anything. It is locked. Oh yeah, right. Uh, yeah, maybe we should check out the ambulance in the future. I guess I can sit here making engine noises with my mouth while imagining I'm going somewhere really fast. Corpse. It's the remains of the ambulance driver or mechanic. It's impossible to tell. Really, poor guy. Mm-hmm. Office or oh, tire iron. Just grab that. A sturdy tire iron. This one's locked. It is not locked in the past. Apparently. Lamp. <laughs> it's just a regular lamp. E, another E, another E, 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 it's an E. They should really mix up the letters. It's way too easy to... There's a bunch of E's. To teach on these, these tests. Looks like an upside down tree of some kind. That looks like long, yeah, lungs. Sometimes I wonder if that's how doctors actually see people. Yeah, they have extra vision. Drawers are stuck, but I can't imagine what I need in there anyway. I don't know. Bingo! These are patient files. And of course, the cabinet's locked. Okay, so what happens if I go to the future? Dirty calendar. Was the cal- yeah, the calendar was there. Man, that's dusty. It's the 17th of May, which is the National Day of Norway. It's a lamp. Notes. It's full of medical mumbo jumbo and words like hematology, growth rate, pandemic, and the note says, I took your stapler. Now we're even asshole. Doctor something. Doctor Phelps. It looks like the cave floor caved in under the weight of the desk. Gaping hole in the floor. What? Oh yeah, you will enter the gaping hole in the floor. Scissors? Yeah, scissors. Ow. Ow. These are remarkably sharp. <laughs> Skeleton. And who might you be? Nothing but a pile of bones and strips of clothing. Oh. He's dead. It was a long shot, but I kind of hoped that he had survived, uh, somehow survived. There's only one way to get answers now, I guess. I need to find out where he lives. Well, lived. Name tag. Hmm. Reynard Lambert. No address. They probably don't put stuff like that on these tags, I guess. Can I? It has f uh, I was a bit too quick. Box. Glass cabinet. These shelves are full of jars with weird things in them. I should be a bit more patient with the text. It's locked from the outside. I don't think... I don't want to think about what's... Why that's necessary. Uh, cables. Battery. Cables. Wow. Wow, amazing, it actually works. I really didn't think, ooh, keys. Human remains, okay. It's a key, a little small to be door key. Maybe it's for a padlock or a locker of some kind. Human, why is this human remain? It's so freaky. One minute he's alive, the next he's a pile of bones. I see now what you mean. He seems very focused on whatever he's, it is he's busy with. I better not disturb him. 
is inside of some guy, obviously, but I have no idea what any of these stuff is. Most of it looks like really bad balloon <laughs> animals. Nice. Uh, okay, so it was in here. And then there was the... Was it the desk or the file cabinet? Damn. Wrong key. Perfect. It's now open. These are patient files. Too bad they all have file numbers and not names. I need the right number. Okay, so the number on the total. Nice. Jackpot. Lambert's medical file. It has an address on it. One Insula Grove Lake Crichton. That's pretty crap. I didn't get to read the rest. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. It's the same date. So is it like exactly 40 days into the future? Or is something happening on this date? It is locked. It is no longer locked. There, fixed it. I feel really bad taking this, but it's my only chance. I'll need to find out where to keep. Ah, yes, keys. Alright. Ah, poop. I think it was just like. I don't think I can get far on my, on my foot. I don't think I can get far on foot. Wait, this is locked. Wasn't there a stairwell here? Where goes the or does the stairwell go into that room? Uh, desk drawer. Can I check this one? There's a key in here. You didn't take the key? It's a car key, it looks like it's one for the ambulances. I have no idea why a doctor would keep a spear key in his desk, but I'm not complaining. Neither am I, neither am I since we accidentally found the key that we were looking for. Okay, so this is the garage. I just put the key in the ignition and off we go. We are right, we need to go to the past. Because then the car is working. Mm -hmm. Here, out on the road, everything seems so normal. Same moon, same night sky. After an hour of driving, it's easy to forget all about that dead world back there. How could Lambert have survived, though? If he came from the future, how did he not die along with everybody else? I just saw his body in the morgue. Now I'm driving out to talk to him alive. How does that work? Do you just leave a copy of yourself every time you use the box? Is that it? Are there copies of me all over the place now? What if he's not there? What if I changed something and he's not alive at all? Maybe all of this has been completely pointless. Maybe there's nothing I can do after all. Maybe these will be my last days, along with everybody else's. Ugh, the thought ties my stomach in knots. No, I better just not think about it and carry on. Hmm. Did I bring enough gas? That's a God, good question. I hope I brought enough gas. That's a good question, though. But uh, I don't think it would make sense to just leave copies behind. Chapter 6, The Island. Because then that would mean that they will, the police would find several copies of... Joe? 
then they would be okay after the first time we just went back and forth. And then be really confused when we did it several times, because then it would be several drills, and that would be problematic. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm going to end this episode here, since we just arrived at a new chapter, and it seems a good way to stop. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and good night.